All right, people, what's on? And welcome back to another episode of the Ronaldinho Jr. Player Career Mode on FIFA 22 on the channel. FIFA 22? Is it FIFA 22? I think it is. It's definitely not FIFA 21. Let me just check, yeah, it's FIFA 22. I don't know why I got so confused there. Anyway, FIFA 22, Ronaldinho Jr. Player Career Mode. You know what it is by now. If you are new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. If you are still here as a subscriber and returning, hit the notification bell. Make sure that's turned on so you never miss an upload when we drop in this series. It's been a while since I've uploaded an episode in this series. As always, hit the like button. Can we get 10 likes? If we do, I'll upload another episode of this series. If you want me to keep it going, boys, I need 10 likes on every single upload in this series if you want me to keep it going so make sure you hit that like button and without further ado we can now get straight into the episode obviously we are still at Gremio as Ronaldinho Jr we are trying to win uh, the Sudamericana as well as the Brazilian League right now we are currently second in the Brazilian League four points behind Atletico Mineiro in P1 in the league two games in hand on Santos in third place behind us as well this league seems to be all over the place wasn't Atletico Mineiro on eight games Santos have played 10 Two teams behind Santos have played eight, and then Atletico Gio behind them have played nine. It seems to be all over the place. We have a, a, a league match to start off the episode against uh, this team. I can't even try and pronounce that, bro. I'm not even going to. Quabe, I want to say. Quiabe, Quiabe. I don't even know. We're just going to play these guys and not say the team uh, name through the whole uh, game. And let's just get into the game and try and win it. Our stamina's looking very low there, boys. Uh, as well as Jadson Vidigal in striker, who I can't believe is only uh, 72 rated as well. Jadson Vidigal and us looking very slim for stamina. Hopefully we can make an impact in the first half before our stamina bar completely depletes. One man the focus of attention. In fantastic form and the top scorer in the league. Can he add to his tally today? Live on EA TV. I've just seen there, boys. Vidi Gal is actually the top scorer in the league. Hopefully, he can increase that tally. You can see the travelling away fans there for Gremio looking very nice in the kit. Let's see what objective we're going to pick. Hopefully, something to do with assists. Uh, we don't. Three shots on target. That's a bit unrealistic. We're going to go with the dribble success rate of 65%. Uh, and let's get into the game. It's not a kick clash for once. I feel like every team in this league has the same kit. Uh, when we get into the game, it's very hard to tell who's who. Uh, what a nice little contrasting colours here as we win the ball back straight away to start off this game. Hopefully we can start quick, start early. We get the ball into our feet here. I'm going to play it into Vidigal. See what he can do with it. Ronaldo Cabrais. Can he find a pass to Vidigal? Vidigal on the overlap, yes. He's got it into us. Oh, no, it's fell to our teammate. That's holding to shoot because I thought it was going to me. That was nice play from the lads, though. Um, if that player would have just played it back to me there, we would have scored. You see, I pressed shoot there, done the stand and tackle. Oh, Vidigal, what a strike that was. I thought that was going straight in. This guy is in top form. He's not even a real guy in real life. I was going to say we might sign him on another career mode, but he's not even a real player, is he? They don't have the licenses for the players in this league, but what a baller this made-up guy is. With the ball into feet, Vidigal there inside again. Oh, I've got a space to run into in behind Vidigal. Can he find us? He's found us very luckily. I'm going to hit this one across goal. Left footed, it's gone wide. That's a poor shot that needs to go on target there, bro. How have we missed that from so close inside the box? Definitely need to upgrade that weak foot. That left uh, left foot, I was going to say left star. I think we have three star weak foot. That's just not good enough. That needs to go on target. Win that Cabraes. Huge head. We've won the ball to Vidigal. Can he give it back into us, Vidigal? Oh, we were through on goal there. Cabraes, can he find us? He can. Making progress. Look at the dribbling from us. We've played our teammate. Oh, what a save from the keeper. That would have been a great assist from us. Our dribbling's feeling very nice as we level up our pro and upgrade those skill points. Feeling very nice on the ball. It's a nice play, Vidigal. I'm going to put a little dink into the middle. Vidigal on the head. Why is he going for... He's tried to play that across goal there. He should have just tried to hit it on the volley. We've won the ball back, though. That's lucky. We get the finesse shot across goal. What a save from the keeper. Fingertip save. Last kick of the half, I think. Uh, but what a save from the keeper. Let's see how close that was to going in. On the left foot, Kale and top bins there. What a stretch from the keeper. That's a ridiculous save, that, you know. What a stretch from the keeper. The end of the second half here. It's going to be Adson Vidigal. No, it's not. It's going to be Sepe into Vidigal. And it's going to be the end of the half there. And we are absolutely knackered, boys. I don't know if we're going to be able to last this second half. I might have to ask for a sub. Um, but I don't want to get subbed off at nil-nil, bro. Nice play from our defenders there. 
uh, to play the ball out from the back and keep the possession. I do not have the pace here. Can Cabraz find me with the ball though? Into Vidigal. He's going to hold it up to Cabraz. Gives the ball into us. I do not have the stamina or the pace. I'm going to dink it inside to Sepe Cabraz. Oh, he's wasted the possession. Ronaldo Cabraz has not looked himself this game, you know, boys. He's just not been his usual self. Yeah, boys, I'm actually going to request a sub 64 minutes into the game. Um, I'm just, I've got no stamina. You can see in the bottom left there, the stamina bar is so low. When I get the ball, I can't run with it. I can't dribble with it. I'm useless pretty much at this moment uh, on the pitch. So I may as well request a sub uh, and then get the manager to bring somebody else on, you know, and maybe we can win the game with fresh legs. There goes Vidigal. He's going to play through Mirazar. Maybe we can be involved one last time. One last time before we go off at the near post. Let's go, boys. Come on. We've just requested a sub. And obviously, we've got to wait for the ball to go out to play. And as we are waiting, we go ahead and score the goal to open up the score in the first game of the episode. What perfect time. And that was I, just one last attack. The home fans or the away fans, our fans, don't look very happy by that goal. I don't know why. But, yeah, very nice finish from us. On that left foot I was just talking about before. Great play from the lads there. Get in, boys. And now we have been subbed off, as you can see. The manager's going to be happy with that performance there. Let's go. 10.0 rating. One goal, two shots on target. Let's go. Oh, boys, we've simulated the match because we've been subbed off. Uh, and we actually lose the game 2-0. That's not good. That's not what we like to see. We got subbed off in the 71st minute. Conceded in the 80th. And then in the 82nd, the boys just absolutely crumbled. Look at that, though. We had 11 shots and 6 chances compared to their 2-2. Two and two. That is not what we like to see. But that's a loss in the league. That is unlucky. After that game, though, boys, we have leveled up, as you can see, level 13 now. We have four more skill points. We are absolutely flying up the ranks. I'm going to go ahead, boys, and pick up this upgrade right here, as you can see. Attack and positioning, plus three. And agility, plus three. Now, attack and positioning, I don't think, is like affects us as a player. Um, it says this increases your player's offensive awareness when you're not controlling your virtual pro but obviously we can control our pro in every game so attack and positioning as a stat doesn't matter but we get plus three on the agility and we can upgrade that again i believe we get another plus three on agility that brings us to 89 agility which is going to make us feel absolutely rapid in game cannot wait to get into the game now and try this out we are up to 81 overall as you can see and um, we've just gone up to 88 dribbling that is absolutely massive that loss has seen us move down to third place in the league, boys. Atletico Mineiro picking up another win. Nine games, 25 points for them in first place in the league there. If we win this game, though, uh, and Internacional lose, then we will go back up to second place. But we are playing Ciara. I don't know how to pronounce that again. Um, but they are sixth in the league, so they are still within the range here, as you can see uh, on the screen here. It shows the top six. They're still up there, you know, 14 points, only four points behind us with the same amount of games played. Uh, and our stamina, again, is so low, boys. Maybe we should uh, upgrade our stamina and swerve all this passing and shooting and, and dribbling traits. Maybe we just need to upgrade stamina because look at that. We've had a few days off. We got subbed off in the last game and we are still on three quarters of the bar. Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hosts have been scoring freely all season, but they face the best defence in the league. Who will come out on top? Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Well, boys, this looks to be a very good game, as you've just seen there. Gremio, us, of course. If you don't know by now that we play for Gremio, I don't know what you're doing watching episode 5 of the Ronaldinho Jr. player career mode. Of course, we play for Gremio. We are currently the top scorers in the league as a team. We have scored the most goals out of anyone in the Liga do Brasil. But the team we are playing have conceded the least amount of goals in the entire league as well. So... It's going to be a very tough game. Let's get into it. Can we try and score some goals against this solid defence um, that this team play? Let's find out. Vidigal, he's got the ball into us already. Let's try out this new dribbling that we've got. Yes, Vidigal, Vidigal, Vidigal. It's a great ball through. I've put it across goal and chipped it. What a finish that is. That's Ronaldinho Senior-esque. What flair and ability that is. And we've opened the scoring already against this strong defence. After three minutes, Ronaldinho Jr., what a player. What a finish that was. Vidigal, perfectly timed through ball. I thought he put too much weight on it. The keeper should have got that, to be honest. If the keeper ran out all the way, he probably would have got there first. But a brilliant finish from us. Just dinking it over the keeper. Look at that. That is so satisfying to see. The keeper should have got that as well. This keeper's poor. But um, it's the best defence in the league. So we love to see um, those big pearly whites of Ronaldinho Jr. in your face there. That was a bit of a weird camera angle. But let's go. Yes, Cabraz, switch it. Can he find us with a pass? It's a decent pass. Can we get a good first touch in front of us? I need man in the box. Vidigal's there. 
Couldn't get in front of the defender. It's a big head from Cabrais again. I want this ball to feet. I'm going to play our teammates in behind. Back inside, yes. Oh, we didn't have the pace to give him the option inside. He's put a ball into the box. Can our teammate win that again? Yes. I want the ball to me feet. I'm going to hit this one. Far post was a save from the keeper. Great strike from us there. Haven't been able to control possession, but their speed of attack when they win the ball back has been breathtaking. It's been a really good performance from them so far. It's great dribbling from us. We've played through Vidigal, who hits the ball over the bar. Vidigal in great scoring form in the last few episodes. And we've been in great assisting form, if that's even English. Uh, we've assisted a lot of goals in the last few episodes. Nearly got one there, but Vidigal puts it over. Ronaldo Cabrais, he's going to try and ping one in behind for us. We've got no stamina. We beat the defender to it, but again, no stamina. You've won the ball there, though. Oh, that's poor from me. That is poor. Why did I pass that? I should have just shot. I've tried to get an assist, but here comes Vidigal off the bar. No way. Should have been 2-0 there, boys. I should have scored, and then Vidigal should have scored back to back. Half time, no, 1-0. I don't even think we'll be able to make it to the end of the second half again. Our stamina is so low right now. We have games coming back to back in like two days between the games. There's not enough time to rest. We might have to sit this half out again to try and build our stamina back up for the next game. Yes, in behind. Left back is out of position. It's me against the world. I've got four defenders in front of me. What can I do with the ball here? I found Cabrais on the edge of the box. And he's going to give it back to us. Cabrais, it's a bad pass. We've got the ball into Mirazar. Cabrais, he's picked the wrong pass. We were through on goal. Oh my God, what a save that is from Adrian Sheetha. I don't know what our defender was thinking there. Just let their player run straight past and let the ball go past. Great save from the keeper. Boys, we might have to request a sub here. You know, I'm doing absolutely nothing. We'll wait till the 60th minute at least. Remember what happened last time? We waited till the 70th and then ended up scoring. Um, I'm, what a save from Shito again. This guy in goal has kept us in the game. Here's the counter-attack. I wanted to play through Cabrais. He's not made the run, though. Oh, Ronaldo Cabrais, what is going on with this guy this episode, boys? You know how much of a legend he is in this series so far. He's just not been his usual self this episode. Somebody's cursed him. I'm going to request a sub here again, boys. 1-0 up. I'm just not, like, quick enough. I've got no stamina left. There we go, boys. We get subbed off in the 70th minute. Again, I think 9.8 rating, one goal. Uh, obviously, the goal that's separated the two teams right now. We're winning 1-0. Let's simulate the rest of the match and hope we don't lose this one like we did in the last game. Come on, boys. Only 20 minutes left in the game. And we seal a victory there, 1-0 to us. Great goal from us to open the score. And in the third minute, then there was pretty much no action since then. But let's get to the next game. As you can see, boys, we are now the top scorer in the league with seven goals in ten games. But um, there's only two days or three days technically between games here. Uh, and the next game is against Internacional, who are third in the league. Then we have a Sudamericana game a bit later on in um, in the week, uh, which I think will be in this episode as well. Um, the first leg of the quarterfinals. We'll just look at this for a month, boys. We have, uh, obviously, we just played Ciara then. Now we have Internacional. Then there's th uh, four days and another game. Four days, another game. Four days, another game. Three days, a game. Three days, another game. And then four days again. There's so many days or games, I should say, in the month of August here. Um, and I'm wondering, are we ever going to get a transfer offer? Does anybody actually want to buy us? It says that the transfer window is open. So I'm surprised nobody's put an offer in for us. We're an 81 rated player now. Our market value should be quite high. I don't even know if we can check that uh, somewhere. We actually can. So our current market value is 50.5 million. Um, so if somebody was going to come in and put an offer in for us, you know, it'd have to be a massive team. Like, I'm thinking here, yeah, boys, we might get an offer from, like, Norwich or someone like that. You know, just a little a little rubbish team in the Prem or something or in, in the Championship. Um, but, no, we've got 50 million of the transfer, but uh, pro like, not budget. What am I talking about? Pr transfer value. Um, we are 81 rated and 17 years old, though, so that does make sense. Um, and we've played 18 games, scored 16 and assisted 14. That's a phenomenal record at just 17 years old. Anyway, boys, without further ado, let's get into the game against Internacional. We are going to be slacking on stamina again. They said our energy was 75, uh, which isn't good, as you can see. We are low on stamina yet again. Hopefully, we can beat these, though. Um, it's I think we're currently tied on points in the league as well. So, whoever wins this goes second in the league. So, it's a must-win game, really, for us. And we're about to bring you live Cabrais there with a pass intercepted again. This guy is just not on his game this episode. I don't know what's going on with them. 
Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. It's a great start from Internacional. That's all led from Ronaldo Cabrais giving the ball away. Not very like Cabrais, but you give the ball away and we've conceded from it. We need a big redemption in this game if we want to get anything from it. Couldn't hang on to it. That's big minis are Cabrais. Find us Vidigal. Somebody we were both open. Uh, we, we was open for both of their passes there, Cabrais. He's found us offside, I think. Good save from the keeper. We weren't offside. Oh my god. That header was a shot as well. Oh my god, boys. We weren't offside there. I and mean, we've just bottled a chance one on one. That is not like us. Yes, Cabrais. Great ball in. We're going to go near post. Let's go. What a finish that is. Ronaldo Cabrais picking up an assist. Maybe he's getting back. To his old ways he's redeemed himself though for giving the ball away at the start of the game and we go ahead and equalize the score in there one one let's go boys this is a nice play we've got a gap opened up there what a save from the keeper that is absolutely insane boys no way we should have scored that bro that's a ridiculous save from the keeper look at the jump that he's put up there that's crazy bro Yes, Vidigal. Players through. Great pass from Vidigal. Oh, we've put it wide. No way. I was about to get up and start celebrating. What is going on with our shooting, bro? The way Vidigal dragged the ball back there to create the space and then the gap for us to run into and play it through. Perfect pass. Our manager's saying we should have scored that. And we should have. We really should have. Wow. We're showing a promising threat going forward, though, in the attacks, you know? So it means another goal's coming for sure. I can feel it. It's just a matter of when. Perhaps a little bit too much here. This is a great play from the lads. Here's Cabrais. Great pass. Come on, we've got to score that one. And we do. Let's go, boys. It is two goals for us, our third of the episode. Putting our little Spanish dance in there. Let's go, boys. Another assist from Cabrais, I think. Making up for that mistake in the first half. Or in the first few minutes of the game. Great strength. Great turn. And then a great finish from us. Finally, getting the ball on target. And in the back of the net, let's go. Vidigal, let's go. Into Cabrais and Vidigal. Can uh, the the dream trio link up? It's a terrible pass from Vidigal. Uh, I don't know what he's thinking, just blasting the ball into me there, but we've got it back again. I want to try and turn here. It's a lovely turn. Into Vidigal. It's Cabrais to Midiza. It's not even Midiza, it's our left back. Great strike, good save from the keeper, though. It's going to be half time. Vidigal gets subbed off at half time. I don't know why. Um, he's obviously a very good player, Vidigal, and he's played quite well so far this game as well. So I don't know why the managers decided to take him off there. Can we get a hat trick though? We need one more goal in this half. Can we do it? Yes. Into uh, Cabrais, into the sub striker. He's put it wide. That sub striker uh, who just came on for Vidigal it took so long to give me the ball. Then, then by the time he gave me all the space and and was was gone. You know what I mean? So I'm not liking this guy already so far. To get Look at this guy, man. Play it inside to Cabrais. Where is he going with it? Cabrais. Oh my god, he's at the post. Why did Cabrais not hit that? Why did Cabrais not hit that? It would have been an assist for us. Easy goal there. That's a nice play. I'm going to try and switch this. Watch this for a pass. Great ping across the, uh, the pitch to Mirazar. Yes, Cabrais. Players through. Why has he not played us through? Nice finish. I'm not celebrating with him though because he should have passed to me. And I'm selfish and I wanted a hat-trick. Uh, but yeah, I'm running the opposite way. I'm not celebrating with that guy. Trying to take Vidigal's spot. Um, no, why has he run back? I don't even want to touch him. Get away from me. I don't actually want to be in this. Like, I don't want to look at him. He's hideous. But um, that all came from us switching the play. Uh, and it's actually a nice finish to be fair. He stopped the ball dead and then pinged it. That's three assists in this game right now for Ronaldo Cabrais. After me giving him stick all game. Uh, or all episode, I should say, actually. You know, he's back to his old self. Three assists, hat trick of assists. Shame we can't get a hat trick of goals because, you know, someone selfish up front wouldn't pass to me then. It's a nice ball over the top into us. I want to try and beat these man off the dribble, even though I've got no stamina. Should have passed it. That's so selfish for me. Should have passed that there, but I wanted a hat trick, bro. And I've got no stamina left to try and make any plays or anything like that. Um, let's just try and close out the game in a 3-1. There we go, boys. 3-1 victory in that game there. Shame we couldn't get the hat-trick, but we'll take the win and the two goals all day, every day. Let's see how much rest we get before the next game. Hopefully a lot, because our stamina bar is going to be completely empty. We only get four days of rest before the first leg 
of the quarterfinals of the Condembol Sudamericana against Atletico. We are playing in the quarterfinals here. Uh, we will get to this one in the next episode, boys. Unfortunately, I have to cut this episode shorter than usual. We're going to do our training first, actually. I have to cut this episode shorter than usual, so I have, can only apologise. I need to go and do something. Um, but hopefully you have enjoyed this video. Get it to 10 likes to see the next episode. And we will continue our Sudamericana campaign with both legs of the quarterfinals. I will show you actually the calendar. You know what? Because I'm cutting this episode short, I will finish the month of August in the next episode. If you get this video to 10 likes, boys, that's all you need to do. If you want me to continue it going, which means the next episode will have one, two, three, four, five, six games in. I normally only do four games per episode. I've done three today because I need to go. But yeah, if you want to see the next episode, like, comment, share and subscribe and I will catch you next time, boys. Take it easy.